Thanks for joining us today. Um, could you tell us your name and a nickname if you have one? Uh, I have a long name. My first name is Akiteya, last name Jantara Prapa. It's a Thai name, it's usually pretty long. So I will go by my nickname New, as in New York. New, as in New York, awesome. And uh, so what's your education background? Have you been other universities, um, high school? Uh, I got my high school and my undergrad back in my country, in Bangkok, Thailand. And I also got my MBA here at the University of Missouri, and right now I'm studying PhD in economics. Great. And uh, when, when will you be graduating? Hopefully this May. This Hopefully, May. cross of my finger. And uh, have you been in any other countries besides Thailand and the United States? Uh, many countries. I've been to, well, Japan. Hong Kong, Singapore, New Zealand, Australia, France, Germany, England, Austria, Belgium. Yeah, that's what I can think of right now. And so, uh, what what was the transition like coming from Thailand and then those other countries to the United States? Was that difficult? Was it? Well, the only weird part is. I'm from Bangkok. I live my whole life in Bangkok and it's a pretty big city, a very hectic city. Technically, we have around 10 million people. So first time when I drive from Columbia Regional Airport into downtown Columbia, and I look at the map and they say, okay, you go to the university, the university is in downtown. And when I saw the first building, it's like the university, uh, the hospital, it's like four story tall. And I'm like, yeah, I'm going to downtown. And I keep looking, looking to see a big building. And then that's it. That's the tallest building from Broadway. And yeah, that kind of weird. And then are you involved in any student organizations on campus? Uh, yes, I am currently the president of Thai Student Association. This is my second time being the president of Thai Student Association. I served my first time in 2003 to 2004. And I'm also working with Missouri International Student Council, technically as assistant to the president. And uh, what, what are the missions of these organizations? What do they do? Uh, I would go with Thai Student Association first. Uh, Thai Student Association, we basically have two main objectives. First, we want to gather together, support, uh, act like a second home, second support group for our members who are far, far away from home. Like get together, we have party, we have potluck, and then we have activity together, play sport. That's our first mission. The second mission is to try to uh, to try to acknowledge, to try to make people in Colombia know more about our country, know more about our culture. So we're trying to bridge the gap, like make them know Thailand better. And then, uh, do you have any kind of interesting stories about when you first got to Colombia or uh, the transition between Thailand and Colombia? I actually don't have uh, that other than my first shock when I see downtown Colombia. Right. But what I have like working in as a president of Tyson Association is one time at one time a couple of years ago, well we've been doing a lot of exhibition. We've been to every single international bazaar and then we even went to a hospital that has some diversity event going on and we set our booth there and stuff. But one, but one time we went to an elementary school and that is the best experience I ever had with, with uh, doing the cultural presentation of my country because you, all, you have like all the first to sixth grade and they were really, really interested in your culture. They asked you a lot of questions, they asked you to do some kickboxing and that was 
fun. And after we done with our presentation, we saw a lot of kids running around trying to kick each other, doing the move that we just did on the stage. So I like that. Well, thanks for your time, Leah. It was good talking to you. Okay, thank you.